You are about to just bounce. Bounce into a commitment cell? Yes, I feel like <laughs> for whatever reason it gives it gives me such great an honor to tell you that your person is I feel like is ready. After ten thousand years, so when I'm done, oh now here they come. <laughs> okay, Sage. If that's not your tea, I don't know what is. Welcome to my channel. I'm Sal. I do the readings here every day. Depending if I'm busy with our jewelry collection, of course, and our newest, I have a newest venture. I'm excited. I'll share with you a little bit. Um, I do here every day. I do here. I do your readings every day for your career, finances, and your relationship. And I will teach you guys how to manifest, you know, the good things for 2024. The top two crystals that everyone should have. I'll share in a little bit. You know when life is good, life is good, so... Mm. And normally it's good when you're just you. Because <sighs> the Queen of Wands is strong, independent, confident. I mean, you do roll the red carpet and people, meaning, you know, people lay the red carpet for you. You're someone who's good to be around with, like jovial, like, you know, like you're confident. She's also like embracing her, uh, you know, S-E-X-uality. Um, she, she feels like she's in a point in her life where I just know me. You know, early we are part of our lives, you know, uh, we are still discovering. And then, but as you grow more older, you kind of get to understand more of you. Not to the whole 100, but here you're just more confident as you are finally, <laughs> I have to say this, flipping the page of life, another chapter, because it's your birthday, right? Um, December 16 is officially when the sun will move to... Sagittarius, don't get confused, I do sidereal, okay? And sidereal astrology, which means I do Vedic astrology, we just look at the sun. So right now, the sun is in Scorpio. So I know, your whole life, you were it was a lie. You were a Scorpio the whole time, but you thought you are a Sagittarius. And you're going to tell me, of course, but I resonate with Western. There's nothing wrong with either or, okay? I'm just I just want you confused. No, it's not. So... Queen of Wands with a chart, you may have bought a new car, you know, moving, relocating, the adventure begins, Sal. As I face my new chapter, 2024, I'm looking forward to what is out there for me. Isn't it exciting? Another year, right? So the chariot here symbolizes you, which is good. The good, the bad, and the ugly, which is the sphinx, the riddles of life. And then the guides over here on top, the stars over there, that's, you know, basically the star. That's astrology, actually. So you realize that everything in your life has happened for a reason. And now is the time for you to embrace it. Embrace what, Sal? Four of Wands, a relationship. <laughs> Someone is single and ready to commit. Nine of Pentacles with the Four of Wands. We love that. We totally love that. I'm seeing here right now, okay, here's the tea. Your person is confident and able to provide for you. Good. Single and not ready to mingle because they want a couple. Mm -hmm. It's here. Now, having the Nine of Pentacles with the uh, Four of Wands here, for others, if you're just you and you're not involved with anyone, this means like you're moving to a new place or buying your first property. Nine of Pentacles with the Four of Wands. I'll tell you the two crystals that I use when I got mine. Well, one first. Okay. I'll tell you later. Now, a happy relationship is in the card for you guys. It can be with a Cancerian or a Leo. Okay, and disaster strikes. Oh, bigger disaster. I thought the first card was, uh, and then, hi, yeah. It feels like you want to reverse December to November, like a horror movie, basically. Because you got seven of swords and a ten of swords. Either you are avoiding someone because you don't trust them. This is escapism, self-sabotage. You've been... Um, uh, you've been betrayed so many times that you just don't see yourself committing anymore. So you are beyond, you know, you're one of the best crystals. Jaded, you're jaded, <laughs> okay? Because you're looking at your person like, come on. And it's like, oh, they want to be with me. Seriously, Sal? Seriously? That's, it. That's what you're saying here. Seven of Swords with the Ten of Swords. You've given up on this connection. You will find out the truth. Knight of Cups. And the strength card, oh, it was a struggle for you to stay committed to this person because you understand that your person was doing something shady. Mm. And yet you stayed. Interesting. So now you're saying with the chart and the strength card, yep, that's why I'm gone, Sal. Mm. Big arguments. 
Five of Swords with the Star card right here. It feels like you... Um, I've seen this reading before a long time ago. Uh, and every time I see this, I feel like I'm wearing flannel. Last year I was doing your reading also, Sag. I don't know. An OG would have to remember that. It's always a deja vu. Where you feel connected. Because if I have cup, five of swords with a star card, you feel so connected with this person. You feel like this is the one. But you guys had a big argument. There's two crystals that everyone should have. Citrine and obsidian. I'm telling you, I have manifested money, business, the house, the car, and of course, the relationship. So if you're stuck and you don't know what's going to happen in your 2024, turn it around today. Get your citrine and obsidian. I would recommend ordering before 2024. Our website is eatreadlove.me. Big argument. And you, I mean, I know you felt like this is the one, but then... I don't know if you're willing to forgive them. Oh, pressure is on. You got a judgment and a six of wands. Okay. So if you are trying to remove, like, let's just say the ten of swords, like you don't want to carry this next year. I mean, this dark energy that will, just, you know, feel oppressed about it. Obsidian, remove negativity, attract prosperity. This stack, it comes in three kinds. You can check it out now. And it comes with the free Queen of Fortune. Gold, 18 karat gold vermeil right here with citrine. And this is the perfect combination. And this is free, guys. Okay. We ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. And we shipped also, um, you know, if you go to the collection, you can get this for free. And in the US, this is free shipping. Yes, this stack in particular. And a lot of people are with the star card, star of ones. Like they want, I'm seeing here that you're trying to manifest a good future for you. Now, the good future starts where you're always at is from your home. The star and the four of ones is right here. And during this time, of course, there's going to be a lot of cleansing before you come into the new year. And ladies and gentlemen, Nes Matana. Our newest website for Miracle Gifts is available now. This is the first one. This is our first release. You can check it out now. It's in the web, it's in the description box below. You'll be surprised. So I created a special gift for, you know, like certain things that everyone should have at the house because everyone asks me, what is what are you there? What is that? You know, because everything has a specific purpose for me. It's all in that box. Okay. Do check it and I will I will see you in that, uh, <laughs> in uh, how to go teaching you how to use it. Okay. Because there's a, there's a way on how to use what I have put inside the box. Mm. Four of Swords with the Ace of Swords. Okay. Hmm. The truth is out. Everything is now clearer than ever. You see things for what it is. Nine of Cups with the King of Pentacles and the Five of Cups. I'm seeing that your person is upset. That you're able to put a break into this. Because you have a judgment. It feels like you realize the wake-up call that in order for you to be happy, in order for you to succeed in life, that there are things that you cannot carry with anymore. Because you have the judgment here in the Six of Wands. It feels like you have given them enough chances to come clean, but they always have secrets. The moon is here. There's always a darker side to your person. And that's where you disconnected because this is where you always get your price. It's almost like it's an onion where you peel every time and then you see it's something. Oh, it's another one. There's always something hidden from your person. This is what I'm seeing. And that pushes you to the judgment. Okay. So don't forget, visit our website, eatreadlove.me and Nesmatana. I will see you guys tomorrow.